responders in Massachusetts are getting the coronavirus vaccine. They started getting their shots today all over the state. WBZ's Christina Hager is live in Walpole tonight. And Christina, first responders are eager to get this vaccine. Well, Lisa, of course, the vaccine is voluntary here, and 90% of the police force here in Walpole opted to get it. So the chief says he is hoping it will take some of the edge off a job that's already full of stress. I'm a little nervous. Walpole police chief John Carmichael about to get the COVID-19 vaccine just after recovering from the illness about a month ago. I wasn't worried at all. And then reality struck on that Saturday morning when I got the aches and pains and by Sunday, I, it was, I've never been so sick in my life. All right. You're all right, guys? After months entering countless homes during the pandemic, often in close contact with strangers. It's uh, something that I think weighs heavily on their minds. Police, fire and EMS workers from Brockton to Worcester and all across Massachusetts now get their shot at immunization. Needham Police Chief John Schlittler. We're really worried about bringing something home to, to our loved ones and, and to our parents and so forth. In Lawrence, the acting fire chief, Robert Wilson, says he did bring it home to his wife before Thanksgiving. Some of the symptoms are quite severe. The peace of mind worth any nervousness the small stick of a needle might induce today, he says. Back in Walpole, it was over before Chief Carmichael even knew it went into his arm. That was it. There That's it. Oh, You're all done. Wow. That wasn't bad at all. I feel great. I'm really excited about our officers and everything that are going to be getting it because it's been a long year. The first responder vaccine rollout goes on all week, and the health department will be back here next month to give officers their second dose. In Walpole, Christina Hager, WBZ News. All right, Christina, thank you. So